So the count the cold came back though. Somebody explain to me if the cold came back or not at the end the bottom of the comments. I guess it came back. It ain't that cold, but it's cold. And my stomach cramping. Whew. What up though, Lowe's? Drop it to the floor, cause it ain't Lex Love. What's going on? Welcome to Monday. Two videos in one day. You got a makeup Monday video today. You got a vlog today. So if you're watching, hold on, let me focus myself because I don't want nobody talking shit. Y'all don't be talking shit, but hold on. Hold on, hold on, I gotta be focused. Hold on. I don't know if it's gonna focus me. There we go. Okay. So if you're watching this vlog, and you haven't watched the Makeup Monday video, you need to head your ass on over to the Makeup Monday video and watch that. Now that video is about things I've learned in 2017. What I learned in 2017, that's what that video is about. So go check it out right now. Go like, comment, and subscribe. Y'all can't just be here for the vlog. Y'all got to be here for all the content. Beauty, lifestyle. I mean, if you want to like, if you just like vlogs, that's fine. If you a guy. Or if you're a girl, you don't like makeup, that's fine. But at least watch the Makeup Monday videos. Because I do my makeup and I talk about certain topics. So, yeah. If you want me to address a certain topic, let me know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, today, I'm going to work. I'm about to go over Keisha House right now. We got to talk about a few things. And then I'm going to work. I want some coffee. So bad. I think I'm about to go to... Y'all, I'm getting smaller. And it's like scary smaller like now my stomach's still a little chunky i ain't gonna lie but i can tell a difference like when i put my coat on i can tell a difference when i um when i put my coat on when i was putting my belt around my waist i was like i'm little and my booty look like flat pancakes so i need to start doing some squats because i don't naturally have a flat booty pancake booty but I'm about to start getting back in that gym. I got to build me some muscle at the bottom part. Because I don't like being skinty, skinty. Nah, I don't want to be skinty, skinty. I want to be like, still have thighs and butt. But still be healthy. But still have my stomach a little flat. Nah, I don't want to be like thighs. I ain't never had, I don't have like hips or nothing. But my, I want my legs to be a little, little chunky, dunky. You know? That's just how I want to look. So, I need to start doing my squats again. Because as soon as I start doing squats though. Probably like two days, I see an increase. Like my booty start getting like lifted up, so it's, that's no problem. But girl, 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 I was looking at myself like I feel weird with my face looking this little, or maybe I just look contoured down to the ground. And I think I look little. Maybe that's what it is. <laughs> I don't contour for dear life, and then tell my I feel like I look like I'm getting skinny. No, ma'am. <laughs> that's funny. All right, but I'm on my way. To the grocery store right now. And I'm going up to house. Do I got my camera and my phone? Oh. Girl, I've been left about that without my phone. Got the camera in my hand. Alright. That is my dog show. My dog. That is my dog. That's my dog show. That is my dog. So yesterday I was just feeling like, oh bro, I can't even explain how I was feeling. I came on my period and my stomach was cramping. And I don't know, I just was so so just uh, all over the place. But today is a brand new day. And that's one thing that we, well, we're not promised a brand new day. But if you live to see the next day, it will be a better day. Trust me, if you allow it to be a better day. Now, if you want to drag yesterday into the day, then I ain't got nothing for you. But if you want to wake up and be brand new and say, I'm going to have a good day today or I'm going to be positive, you know what I'm saying? And... I really didn't feel like going live today to do my makeup. I really didn't feel like it, but I was like, Alexa, you need to just go ahead and do it. And y'all made me feel a lot better. Like, I don't even know. I can't, like, it, it didn't seem like she was wrong with me, but I was just really, like, in my own head, feeling like, ugh. And being on live with y'all made me feel, like, better. So, thank you for everybody that gets on my lives, that really talks on my lives. Even if you just watch and you don't like to talk, that's cool, too. But to all y'all, like, Imani, um, Leah... Brianna, aka Coke. Um, who else? Nola. I don't want to miss nobody, but y'all know who y'all are, cause that's always say y'all name. Lawrence always on my lives. Like I really do appreciate y'all, like engaging with me, talking to me, 
because it just means a lot to me. It does. It means it means a whole lot to me. Y'all never about to cry, so I don't even don't even let me just not. But it means a lot to me. Like that really made my day, and that really just set the tone for my day in general. All right, so I'm about to go to Publix, and I'll talk to y'all when I get there. My favorite song. I just wanna get one lemonade. I need a um a simply lemonade for my greens on the go. But I'm about to go to work and I don't wanna leave them in the car. So I'm gonna get one. I'm trying to debate on food. I want some. I think I'm gonna get sushi out of here. But I don't know. I kinda want some fruit. I need something though, because I can't I can't go to work without um Cantaloupe is probably gonna get one free, but normally when it's probably gonna get one free, it's nasty. So now it ain't gonna work out. The neighborhood butcher, he said he wanna be on camera, y'all. You gotta say hey, you gonna say hey? How you doing? He said, well, how you doing? <laughs> Welcome to Georgia. <laughs> so I ended up getting some sushi. I always, I only like sushi that has cream cheese in there. It has to have crab in there. That's the only kind I like. And I got watermelon and, um, a lemonade and I'm about to get a water too. Cause I and I forgot my hair peels at home. Damn. I had to take them when I get off. I don't know why I don't keep them in my purse. I lost the other ones though, so I'll be like, okay, I'm just gonna leave them at home. But and I didn't eat nothing, that's why I didn't take them when I was at home. So y'all just really thought about the fact that this um that this um what you call it has cream cheese in there and I don't want it. Ew, this sushi. So what I'm gonna eat now? I guess I'm just gonna get watermelon, eat watermelon, and uh, lemonade. I guess that may be the best, <laughs> the best bet. Or so on. I wish I could like show y'all that accident I just saw. How come every time I'm in Atlanta and I'm driving and it's traffic, then I get to where the traffic is. It's a nine car pile. It's a nine car accident. Why do y'all write if you are in Atlanta or if you've been to Atlanta? These people ride on top of each other's ass. Like, they don't know how to give you a car room space. Like, the car, you know how you're supposed to give people the car room lift? So, in case something pop off, maybe the person in front of you might stop abruptly. Maybe you might have to stop. Maybe your car might give out. Maybe your brakes might give out. Why are you riding on people's ass? That's how y'all be getting in nine car accidents. I would never understand that for the life of me. It only took me one time to run into the back of somebody. Y'all think I don't give a whole car? I'll give, like, two car lifts. I'll be like, uh-uh. Cause you don't know what that person might be going fast as hell. You right behind them on their butt. They slam on their brakes. You can't help but slam into them. They and then that's the worst feeling when you get into an accident. Your car on top in the front. Now you got to worry about dealing with insurance. Now you got to. It's just too much. When you could have just stayed a car left to park. It's just crazy. So I was talking to Keisha. I'm on my way to work now. I'm about to go to work. Um, I didn't even get Keisha on the vlog. Sorry, but. We was talking about some business, talking about some stuff. So, yeah, I'm about to go to work. I was looking at this foundation. I tried, if you was on my live, I tried the Bare Minerals, like, Pro Foundation. Uh, Bare Pro Foundation. And I like that it dries to a powder finish. I just don't know if it matches my neck. Like, when I'm in the sun, I was like, I don't feel like this matches my neck. But, nonetheless, I feel like... I do like my makeup today. I feel like it looks really, really good. I really want my hair to be bigger. Like, really, really big. I think I might need to add some more bundles to it. Or, like, make it, like, just bigger. I don't even know how this like. Look what I got. Look what I got. I got some coffee. Baby, baby, coffee. I'm about to drop my damn phone. Ooh. I got some coffee. I'm about to go to this little classy. I'm about to be like five minutes late. Then I find somewhere to park. Ooh. I'm cold. Shit. All right, y'all. So I came to the nail place. I rolled back past it. And yeah, it's not open. It said it was open at 10 o'clock, but I'm pretty sure it opens at 12 o'clock because it is Sunday. But when I looked it up on YouTube, on Google, it said 10 o'clock. So I'm sitting outside. But I'm about to get some gas because I'm damn near on empty. I drove here damn near on empty. I don't know why I did that. Why I did that, but I'm about to get some gas now. And then I'm going to uh, 
come back and get my nails done. I broke another nail. I'm about to tell my nail tech, like, um, young ma'am, I'm going to need for you to um, make these a little thicker. I don't know what's going on with them, but I'm not going to be able. So if they break this next time, I'm probably going to find a new nail tech. I do not like when my nails get to breaking. It just annoys me so bad. So, yeah, that's what I'm about to go do. Um, yeah, that's it. <laughs> That's it. I learned a lot in the little class. It was really, really like helpful. Um, I learned a lot about different face shapes and like how to contour for different face shapes. So it was really helpful. So I can give you all more information when you ask me different questions. So yeah, I found it to be really helpful. All right, y'all. So I'm walking to go get my nails done. I had to call my nail tech. Like, are you here? She told me some. Yeah, I'm in here. I'm like, good. I'm gonna get my nails done, and I cannot wait because my nails look fucking horrible. I was supposed to go to lunch today with my little church friend. I, I don't know her name, <laughs> but she, I forgot. I forgot. She texted me like, "Are we up, are still on for lunch?" I'm like, "Oh no, nah, girl." I didn't move my camera up because y'all know it's uh, it's unsafe. Hold on. So first things first, it's cold in this nail shop, and my nail tech. She's not gonna be here till one o'clock. So. So I gotta wait on her to be here. Yeah, this heater is saving my life right now. It's so damn cold. All right, y'all, I'm leaving the nail place. Oh, it's cold. Oh. And I'm hungry. I got my nails done. I ended up getting blue, like navy blue. So thank you, Star, for suggesting that. Whew. I'm annoyed. Okay, so the nail shop pissed me off. Let me tell you why. So, oh, I feel like my hair look like with fro. Okay, anyway. So, I go in the nail place, and first off, I call her. I told y'all I called her. I said to her, I said, yeah, are you at the shop? She's talking about, yeah, I'm in there. But she keep asking, who is this, who is this? So, I'm gonna just blame it on she didn't hear what I said. So, it's 12 o'clock. It's um, what time is it? It's 12 o'clock at this time. You know they open at 12 o'clock. One o'clock hit, she talking about, oh, I'll go in there. The lady act like she don't understand what I'm saying. Like she can't hear. So I said, okay. So I'm like, can I go to the bathroom? She act like she don't, she don't speak English. Bitch, I know you speak English. I come here all the time. Stop playing with me. She like an older lady. Okay, cool. So she like, it's gonna be, so I go to that Heidi thing. She like, it's gonna be one hour. So you're not coming until one o'clock? So why the fuck didn't you say that? You know I gotta pay for parking. Okay, so we already started off on the bad note. So I'm like, okay, cool. Y'all know I had four nails that was broken. Um, Y'all know I had four nails that was broken. So I, um, so I, she like, oh, so she comes and I'm like, why didn't you tell me that you was, was coming at one o'clock? So she didn't say nothing, she just sitting there looking. So I'm like, okay, cool. So. I had four nails that was broken. When I tell y'all she pulled these damn nails off, it didn't hurt, but I didn't like it. So I was like, yeah, I didn't like it. Then, she puts me some new nails. She put the new nails on. Why two of my nails crooked, bro? Okay. I just want somebody to explain it to me why two of them crooked. So I'm like, Kaidi, this don't look crooked to you? So she gets the filing on one side. She gets the file on one side and I'm just still stuck because I'm like, it still look crooked to me. I, I was still confused. So, in that moment, I decided that I'm not um, getting my nails done for a minute until I find a new nail tape. <laughs> I'm like, I can't even do it. Then, I didn't even have to, I was, then I was, I was just mad overall. All that pissed me off and then I just got mad overall. So, I was mad I had to pay for parking, but luckily the machine was acting crazy i wasn't able to put my money in there like and my nails was too long to pull the card out so i had to pay with cash so i pressed the little button and like let me go for free because it wasn't an attendant but i'm just like i'm just kind of over it because i don't know you could at least apologize like oh damn you was waiting an hour you act like you ain't even give a damn and my nail is my nail is crooked like real life it don't look crooked on here but it's crooked what well, two of them are I'm trying to see if I want to get one of these Publix little dinners, but they don't have the ones that I like. They only have like beef and steak and pork. So let me tell y'all what happened when I went to the nail place. So 
I like this foundation, but I feel like it's a separate shade for my neck because my neck is darker, but then it matches my bottom part. But I put foundation on there, so I put foundation on right here. I need to figure out something for hyperpigmentation on my neck because my neck is just darker. Until I tan in the winter, it just looks that way. It's just dark. See how that look? Not cute, but anyway. So I'm at the nail place or whatever. I forgot to tell y'all this part. I'm at the nail place and this girl comes up to my nail tech. Now you know my nail tech is like, my nail place is like, not in the hood per se, but people consider it the hood, but okay. So, um, my nail tech, she, this girl walks up to her and she's like, um, can you do these type of nails? So they can do any type of nails there. So she's like, um, no, you, whoever put your nails on has to do it. So she's like, you know he don't know how to do nothing. All he know how to do is polish. So when she leaves, my nail tech is like, well, I don't like doing her nails because she don't like to pay money. Last time she wanted all that stuff, I charged her $60 or whatever. <clears throat> so the lady that's sitting next to me, she like, I ain't gonna say she's hood. She probably from Atlanta or whatever. Um, she took like real, real country. She was like, um, she was like, and she looked like she white. So she probably got the money anyway. I said, what they got to do with her having the money? I said, first off, she's mixed. She might be mixed or she might just be light skinned. Secondly, just because you're lighter skinned does not mean that you have a coin. Just because your mama may be white and your daddy may be whatever doesn't mean that you have a coin. Just because you look light skinned does not mean... It's just crazy to see how society's mind is set up. Like, okay, because she's fair skinned, she probably got the money anyway. How she do she had the money? There's plenty of light skinned people that don't have no money. There's plenty of people that have Mexican parents that don't have no money. Plenty of people that have white and black, white and black parents, Mexican and black parents that don't have no money. It was just crazy to me. I wasn't like mad about it, but it was just crazy for me to see, you know what I'm saying, people, someone's reaction to someone else and how we so fucked up as a society. Obviously, she don't got money because if you didn't know, especially in Atlanta, black people that got money, they love to act like, even if they don't got it, they love to act like they got it. You get what I'm saying? If you if you had to pay $70 for some nails, you're going to pay it if you got it. If you ain't got it, you ain't got it. You, you, that's why you that's why you holding the coin okay that's why you holding the coin with a T because you don't have it that's what that boils down to girl's crazy so I have on the Fenty Beauty Foundation in the shade 430 and I feel like it looks so good I have 442 I might do my makeup with 440 tomorrow and just see how I feel about it and then I'm gonna make my decision from there because I feel like this looks good, but I feel like it is light. But I feel like I look like airbrushed, baby. Airbrushed down. Like, I just don't like my neck. I just want to get my neck. I need some bleaching cream or something. I got to figure this out. I'm about to Google it. I'm about to watch She's Gotta Have It Again because that shit was just too good. Yeah, I'm about to watch it again while I upload this video. Hopefully my damn thing. Ugh, I'm so, y'all. The process I have to go to the upload is just too much. It's just too much. I don't think I showed y'all my nails, but I do like them now. I'm still mad at my nail tech, though. But I'm probably going to go back. I'm just going to soak all these off before I go back and let her do me a fresh set. Yeah, they bomb. All right, I will talk to y'all later. I love y'all. Bye.